Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play some Resident Evil Remake. Matt here, and we got ominous music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got hit really hard. Must have been one hell of a drink. <laughs> Oh shit. Lisa Trevor, everybody. One of the most annoying. A really annoying enemy. She is, um, invincible to bullets. But. I guess I got a headshot there. So much for invincible to bullets, huh? <laughs> well, it's, she's still twitching and all that, so. Let's get out of here before she just. Oof. Sounds like she was getting right back up. Good thing I, uh, got away as I, when I did. Ah, zombie. You dirty, dirty zombie. I'm just gonna go away from you. Nope. Bye, I don't care, I don't care. I really don't fucking care. There we go. Let's get the hell out of here. And for those of you who don't know, according to the remake, Lisa Trevor is responsible for the progression of the G-Virus and I think is also responsible for creating the Nemesis Parasite due to the fact that she has the same tentacles such as Nemesis. That's the story they're going with. And what are we going to say? No. Just looking at what I have. Two first aid sprays, a crank, and the infinite samurai edge. Not doing pretty bad, but could be better. Well, time to move on. We got dogs! Hmm? Or not. This is Brad. Hello? Alpha team. Hey, Brad. Come in. Does anybody hear me? This is Chris. This is Brad. Star's Alpha Team. Bravo Team. It doesn't matter. Respond. Hello? Brad, this is Chris. Brad? Damn. This thing's broken. Someone. Yay! No, you back up! Yay, got him! I'm a hero! I got all three of them. I. My god. I think there's a map down here. Can't go that way. Okay, there is no map. I lied to you. I'm a dirty, dirty liar. Fortunately, dogs don't come back as crimson heads. Wonder why. Ah, well. I guess it's not that important. Let's use the crank. Look at that CGI. That's really good CGI. That is really some good CGI. For a GameCube game. Good job, GameCube. You can hear the sound of a waterfall in the distance. That doesn't matter. Let's continue on our way. We gotta make things safe for Jennifer so that way she can avoid the scissor man while we try to avoid our own serial killing killers. Which is the zombies. Okay, there should be doggies down here. Mean doggies. Along with 
thirds, I think. Oh, you fucking bird! Come on, you fucking birds! Okay, guess there's no dogs here. The battery has been taken out. Shit. We need a new battery. And we can't go this way because the waterfall is blocking it. Oh no! It's not like we can go through it. Seriously, why can't we just walk past it? Anyone? Raise of hands? No one? Okay then. Okay, we're clear. Ah, it's just a snake. We'll let it go. Just a couple of snakes. We'll let them go. And now we're in the other part of the mansion. Look at that angle. And all we got is a blue herb. Just one. Ay ay ay. Uh this should be a save room. Hopefully there's ink in here. What do we got? A flash grenade. Ink ribbon! Beautiful, delicious ink ribbon. And we also got a fuel can. We also got um, a kerosene in case we wanted to melt. Wanted to burn some zombies. We're not gonna. We should be fine. Uh, this is locked. This way is... Yeah, let's go this way. We just gotta be very careful. Ah! Nope. Ew. Ew. Eh, eh, ew, ew. Take your lighter and light those. A strange silhouette hovers in the reddish light. Could it have some kind of meaning? No, Chris. No, it doesn't. Ew, it's still bleeding out of its butt. It's got anal leakage. That's disgusting. There we go. Ew. Now you can tell this is definitely the 1990s record players. Spider. Back up. Nope. Careful, it could explode. I uh, like this. Take this red book. A book with a red cover. It's a book with a red cover. Nothing is printed on the pages. It's, it's a special way of using it. Um, that is a first aid box. Sometimes it will contain a mix, herb, compound, or it will contain a first aid spray. And that's a picture of a butt. Like this. And there you go. 365. Remember that, kids. I don't think it ever changes, but... Eh. What's that? Is that what I think it is? Okay, but what's that? Oh, it's nothing. Whoa, what the fuck? Did I just teleport? 
Well, we're done with that room. We don't ever have to go back in that room. Not at all. And now we want to push the box. Yeah. 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 Because if we don't, we'll get attacked by the tentacle monster. Yeah. 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 And we're not Rebecca Chambers. So it would get really awkward. There we go. Now we can safely proceed and get our shit. God, this hallway always creeps me out. Feels like something's just gonna pop out, you know? Yeah, fortunately there's not a lot of zombies in this part of the mansion, which is weird. Anyways, we want to grab this. The map of the residents. You can... You got the map. The hole... There's a hole in the wall here. Don't look at it. Okay, I'll show you why. That's why. That's what happens when you look. You get attacked by bees. And bees are scary enough. Seriously, fuck them. Fuck bees. They're terrible, terrible creations. Okay, since I don't want to deal with him... Come and get me, dickhole. Bye. These can be pushed. Mmm, that sounded juicy. So go on and push them. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I want a room. Oh, yeah. Let's go put the square crank back since we won't be needing it. Also, before we go down there, there's, I do believe, a room we have to check. I think it's this one. Yep, we need to get rid of the, uh, the crank, and maybe we can ditch a first aid spray. Okay, we're back. And now it's time to go explore the area with the ladder. Clink, 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 clink. And now we got box puzzles. Because apparently you need to do this. You know, how did they get past that area to begin with? Did they have to push the boxes like I do? Damn, these boxes, man. Who put these here in the first place? Better yet, what's in them? Uh, let's de-equip that to move faster. To run faster! Do, 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 do. Come on, box! I really don't have much to talk about. I just want to get further into the game. I just want to get further into the game. <laughs> and that should do it. Excellent. Let's go. Uh, a green herb. I will not take it. I will not. And now we get a cutscene. Richard. Hey, Richard. Sop. Chris. 
Yeah, what's up? Chris, stop! No! Oh, God damn it. Richard. Richard has a more heroic death than, um, Jill's side of the story. <laughs> but quickly, run! Because apparently zombie sharks can fade through bars. Fade through them, I tell you! Oh, now the music picks up! <laughs> oh, god damn it! I forgot to grab the key. I'm a dead man. Okay. I forgot to do the shit that I was told said I was going to do first. I need to go back. Oh, whoa! Oh, oh no. Run, Chris! Run back to the door! I find it hilarious that the music decides to stop at a certain point in time, like, eh, whatever. Okay, we're back here, and I was a dummy. I forgot to grab things. I forgot to grab the key. It's number it has number one on it. I'm an idiot. I forgot the goddamn key. <laughs> I'll go. Like it was made for like guests and guards and stuff, right? Then again, they all probably quarantined themselves in the mansion. So that makes sense. Okay. That makes sense. He hanged himself. We got a self-defense gun, which sucks. And a survive and a suicide note. I had to do it, blah blah blah. And sometimes that guy will fall. So, there's a heads up. And we take this down. Now, yeah, take that. Yep, you're gonna get up. Let's get out of here and put some shit away and get back to that room. Okay, we're back, and I got the key this time. I got the control room key. And dropped off that worthless self-defense gun. So it's time to go run away from sharks again. Yay. You have just witnessed my forgetful nature. Ignore the pain, run. It's only a shark wound. You can survive, Chris. You'll be okay. Ah! I'm more fine than I thought. I actually thought it'd bring me down a little lower. The warning lamp indicates that there is an emergency. Gee, I wonder what kind of emergency it is. No, we want to go this way. Caution, in case of a drop in oil pressure control, open valve 2. Let's take a map of the aqua ring. You got to map up the aqua ring. An error message is just being displayed. Something appears to have gone wrong while the water was being drained. There's a switch to the drain. Press it. Yes. 
God damn it. Oh yes, lock all the doors. Release the safety. And you gotta do all this to survive. Oh boy. Oil pressure law, shel shelter operation terminated. Restore oil pressure, then release the safety. Better hurry. Reaching 50% of pressure Two. Threshold. Emergency drainage system immediately. I, I would if I could. Eh. There. There. Now we're good. Man, all the shit you gotta go through to save your ass. Seriously. Umbrella was not the wisest. Now drain the. Drain the goddamn water. We don't need them fucking up our lives. And they're taken care of. Okay, there would be a first aid box there, but no. No, there isn't. And we got two things needed, because we need a key. We're gonna need a key for something. Hello, what's this? Magnum rounds. Yeah, sure, we'll take them. Ow. Oh. Wasted dynamite. Come over here. And we have a wobbling shark. And Richard's assault shotgun, which should be waterlogged and useless. Fires 12 gauge shells, a Star's custom arsenal, and also Richard's favorite. Yeah, let's just use a first aid spray. I don't fucking care. You're going to regret that later. Watch. Mwahaha. Look at this shark. Wonder what they were doing with it. Of course. Now, of course, it won't fight us. Because it's a freaking, you know, giant shark that would try, that would probably try to attack us anyways. That just electrocuted. Now, fortunately for us, the generator died, which means the electricity was cut off. So therefore, we'll be fine. The residence key. The word gallery is imprinted on it. Time to go. Now, the odds of us of having Rebecca help us in um this part is kind of iffy. I don't know the actual things needed to have Rebecca help you. So, if she doesn't help, well, fuck. What a bitch. Right. Right. And, of course, we're going to save our Magnum for something else, of course. There is nothing else here. It is time for us to leave this place for good. I am not. I'm a cure. Let's get out of here. I'm probably also going to stop by the save point and drop off the magnum ammo. Thinking about it. Oh yeah, I gotta go back to the save point anyway so I can get the book. So, I'll just make a quick cut here. 
Okay, guys, we're back. And we got things needed. We got the book, we got the key, and I got weapons. And I'm okay. Use the gallery key here, throw it away, and let's go. There's just a few more things we gotta do before this area is no longer needed. Die. Die. No. Die. Die. Fucking bees, man. Uh, yeah. Green, this should be a six. Oh, yeah, that's right. They don't do the color coordination. Okay, calm down, dude. Remember. Okay. This was red, so that should be a three. This was green, this should be a six. There you go. There we go, dude. We know what we're doing. We know what we doing. We know what we doing. There is something written on the wall. One plus three equals four. Four plus six equals ten. Uh, math. Gee, thanks. I don't know much about medicine, so there's no point in taking an empty bottle. Sorry, Chris just doesn't know. Damn you bees. You will not sting me today. Go fuck yourself. Stupid bees. Leave me alone. Basically go to this corpse and he'll give you insecticide spray. Retreat! Run away! Run away! Time to get revenge on those fuckers. Go here and spray some insecticide. It's a good thing to know, in fact, T-virus infected animal insects are still weakened by poisons. And T-virus sharks are weak against electricity. Then again, with electricity, you can blow up zombie human heads. Um, that's a handgun clip. I'm not gonna grab that. But now it should be safe to grab the key. The number three is on it. Fucking bees. There we go. Open. Bam. Now, what? I forget. What's in this door? If there's a zombie, I'm gonna be pissed. Nope. The roots of some kind of giant plant are sticking out of the wall. Yes, yes. Oh, there was nothing in there. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, let's just solve the puzzle here and let's get and let's get be done with it. Oh, there's a typewriter here too. Anyways, let's take the white book. Organic chemistry and lab experiment. Blah 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 blah. And we put the book inside. And now we solve the puzzle of making a naked lady.
I have no idea why this works. Okay. Now we step through this door and we meet our fate. What is our fate? Well, we're going to find out in the next episode of Resident Evil Remake. I'm your host, Matt, and I'll see you guys later. <laughs>